converging on the spectator stages in Naivasha are blissfully unaware of the post-World Rally Championship hits and misses that follows the event. Amidst the excitement and spectacle of the rally, the enthusiasts find themselves immersed in the thrill of the moment, paying little attention to what comes next. Our reporter Willie Dennis Njiru shines the spotlight on this lesser-known aspect of the rally scene, painting a picture that may be unfamiliar to many fans. As you step through the Elsa Gate at the Hell's Gate National Park the day after the electrifying conclusion of the 2024 edition of the World Rally Championship WRC, you are greeted by a breathtaking scene of tranquility. The air is filled with a serene silence broken only by a gentle rustling of leaves and the distant call of wildlife. Against the backdrop of majestic landscape, the herbivorous animals have returned to their feeding grounds, their graceful presence adding to the park's natural allure. <laughs> Amidst these serene scenes, a dedicated team of workers diligently clears away the remnants of the event, ensuring that the park retains its pristine beauty. Like Kwaizo countries, Zingine, Kamauko, Maju, US, Kienda. Security and traffic management were paramount concerns for the security agencies, as mentioned by the Naivasha OCPD Stephen Kirui. Through strategic planning and execution, they successfully maintained order and facilitated smooth traffic flow throughout the event. We are actually, actually anticipated that uh, this safari rally for this year could have been one of the active ones. So we planned well, very well with a team from Nairobi and a team from Nakuru County. Uh, we focus so much on the, the traffic issue. And then we manage very well traffic. As everybody who had seen actually, it was, uh, it was flowing very well. It, that was just because of the plan that we had and that the deployment of the officers whom we sourced from Nairobi team and of course uh, the Nakuru County. A visit to the nearby hotels revealed a stark condition from the bustling atmosphere of the past few days. Despite experiencing full bookings, the once vibrant hotel lobbies now sit empty. The temporary infrastructure erected for the event, including VIP platforms and communication equipment, has already been dismantled. The landscape once adorned with these structures now standing bare. I want to tell the, 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 um, the participants and of course the spectators that uh, we want to commend you very well for what you did and for the discipline you had and you made the day very successful. We notice that amidst the cleanup efforts, there is a group that remains behind to address the environmental impact left on the wake of the event. Most waste zilikuwa ni chupa, size za, za glass, na chupa hizi za maji, cans za, cans za pombe, nini nini hapo wantu. Hizo ndo tumedil nazo na leo bado tumekuja kuwakikisha tumedil. As the cleanup progresses, the lessons are learned from the event. There is optimism for the days ahead. Behind me is the presidential dais that 24 hours from this moment, it was a functional dais that held the president and the dignitaries who were in the final stage here watching the WRC as it came to a close. And that is the post-WRC events captured real on TV 47. Reporting for TV 47 from Hellsgate National Park in Naivasha, Nakuru County, I'm Willie Dennis Njiru.